It wasn't a question of a race with no end, it was almost a race with no start. This was the first one. The man who suffered most just about to come into picture, right in the middle there, Russell Grady takes a heavy tumble. Result of that one, Grady OK, Carr rather sorry for itself. Dave, what happened there as we look at the replay? You'll see Jonathan Williams in car number 34 uh, gets a bit out of shape whether he's pushed or not, I'm not too sure. That set up a bit of a chain reaction and poor old Russell just sort of uh, is in the wrong place at the wrong time. You see him break and um, it was a monster accident which uh, rather surprising really but uh, as you can see the car gathers momentum and um, I'm sure Russell wasn't too sure where he was uh, by the time all that finished but uh, fortunately he was okay. And so to the next start. And what happened this time? Well, they all arrived at the complex together, but now somebody else got themselves in trouble. This was car number four. Jeff Prince, who took with him poor Nigel Edwards, who ended up in the barrier. Nigel was not impressed. And then all of a sudden one of the cars is coming 90 degrees out of the pack and we're flat in fourth gear, hits the side and straight into the fence. So the front end of the car is a mess, a real mess. So 